Hi everyone, I have got my February Be My Glamantine BoxyCharm Base Box. I'm so excited to share this with you because we all know when it comes to skincare, hashtag Nancy has no idea, but I also got a new Heidi Douse necklace in today from Home Shopping Network. I'm so excited to share that with you. Her jewelry has really gone up in value since I started watching her, but every now and then you get some really good deals on clearance and on the As Is collection. So I hope you stick around and join me. everyone I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel as always I am so excited so happy to see you guys oh it means so much to me that you guys can take a few minutes out of your day to spend with me it means more to me than I can ever let you know so thank you everyone from the bottom of my heart if you are new to my channel I hope that you consider hitting that little red subscribe button over there I would love to have you come back and join me for future videos and yes yeah, so we're going to kind of jump right in today so I got a new necklace in from Heidi Dow probably came in the mailbox the other day but it was 30 below zero and I didn't want to go out go out and tomorrow was supposed to get 10 inches so I figured I'd better walk out to the mailbox today so it came in this uh, gold package and this was a return a customer return or it could have been it was on the as is products so it could have been a customer return or it could have been something that one of the models wore and so they didn't want to sell it as new but it came in that nice gold outer sleeve and this nice black packaging and it is so pretty her jewelry is so glittery and when I first started watching her and I I only have a couple of pieces but they were really all of, all around a hundred dollars and or less and now her jewelry is like three four five hundred dollars but this was uh, one of the could have been a return could have been one something one of the models wore and it's a nice teal tassel here and then these beads are all like faceted so they all kind of have some glitter i'm going to take it out of the box because i don't think that medallion's going to show up against the black too good so let me take that out of the box and show you what this and it's a little long for what i'm wearing today but i just love this so again you got all these faceted little gems here at these little decorations like midway they're all designed and then that same kind of medallion right there I'm kind of holding it crooked and then even on the tassel head it's got the same crystals and then like a nice teal green and even on this clasp here you can see that there's crystals both sides yeah, so doesn't this look so pretty i can't wait to put this on they had this in black too and so the black crystals all have that same kind of shimmer and uh also but then the crystals were all kind of like just clear and so i thought it maybe wouldn't go through so much but I, you can just see the sparkles so stand up so i can show you how long it is but like with a nice sweater or turtleneck i think this is going to look pretty and just having just this glowing against my fish belly white skin i thought it was kind of like a nice contrast so just really pretty just wanted to share that with you all righty so boxy charm so this is called be my glamantine the back always shows you what they've put in here for me they show you the msrp and a little bit about it and so it would be 22, so February 20, and then maybe just dash 20 from BA for base box. I don't know. Alrighty, and, and in the box, I even had a really substantial bubble wrap paper instead of that crappy paper. Yeah, beats me how they figure out who, put, who gets what. But anyway, this first item, and you know, I know nothing about highlighters, but it's so pretty. I don't know. It's the Ace Beauté the glow palette here and it's going to really kind of shine highlighter palette essentials 
and let's see if I can show this. But we got like some golds, some silvery shades, a nice kind of goldish, and then some pink at the bottom. So just really some nice kind of shades to play with. This has a, an MSRP of $40. And if you aren't familiar with BoxyCharm, um, they say uh, for just the base box, um, it's $27.99, so $28 a month. Um, they say the average value is about $175. I paid for the year in advance, so mine kind of locked in at that $25. I don't know. So, I don't know. Didn't know what it was doing, but I don't know. So it does save you a couple of, couple of dollars by, by doing that, and I don't know if they're going to offer that again next year or not. The next thing is a kind of a Detox Max by Timi. It's a green tea blend with matcha, lemon glass, yeah, lemon grass and clay. This has an MSRP of $29.99. It's cruelty free and it does have instructions on how to use it. Now I used a matcha tea mask before and it was one that um, I had like the loose ingredients and I put it together myself and my face really burned. So I don't know if I've got a reaction to the matcha tea. So I will more than likely put this in a future giveaway and it is sealed with plastic. Alrighty, and next I got a palette. Yeah, two palettes in the same box for me. Isn't that weird? So this one is by Wander Beauty. It's called the Escape Eyeshadow Palette. Nice seascape here. So just beautiful palette. There is a mirror in here, so let me try to cover that up. And this has an MSRP of $42. So it's basically a pretty neutral palette. We got some browns, got a nice shade of pink there called Flourish. And then of course sea glass. So we got that one really pop of color. But the others are, you know, are all pretty neutral to make some everyday looks. And maybe just a pop of color here and there with that sea 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 glass. So it is it is a pretty palette. And it is beautiful on the outside. Next we have this and I always always mess up this name. It's Alam Squaw Hydrating Hydrating Setting Spray. And I did take everything out of the boxes already as you can see. And I do love using setting sprays. It just kind of feels like you set your makeup for the day. And Alam Squaw, I mean this brand is in like glossy box and look fantastic boxes a lot. So it is a nice brand. This has an MSRP of $26. So I will enjoy using that. This last one, I wasn't sure if I was going to keep it, but to be honest, I opened it up and smelled it and I don't know, I might have to, but if I do give it away and you get this box, yeah, I had a, I had a little bit of trouble opening it. So this is a Bally Bomb. It's pineapple lip scrub. It smells heavily. Alrighty, so this has an MSRP of $23. And it just, oh my gosh, it just, it smells like pineapple juice. I want to go, go to the store and I'm not going anywhere because I don't want to, but I think I need to have pineapple juice delivered next time. Maybe with some Midori. I think I got Midori downstairs for a melon ball. Uh, this smells so good. So this is, it's a, it's a, it says it's a rich, indulgent sugar scrub. It's packed with juicy pineapple fragrance and exfoliating sugar cane crystals to gently buff and polish away dead skin cells. My lips are still pretty dried. My skin is pretty dried from that med, the, the meds that I got. I guess it's been six, it's been six weeks that I've been on this and so my body just hasn't really adjusted to it yet. I am drinking so much water just to try to keep um, hydrated, but my skin is just really taking a toll with the, the new meds. This is also a new uh, launch. So that was everything that was in my boxy charm. So again, I got, I got a substantial bubble wrap. We got this pineapple lip balm, which I was going to give away, but it smells so good. I might have to keep it. We got the Alarm Squaw, the setting spray. We got the Ace Beauté, the highlighter palette. 
we got the Wander Wilderness Palette, our palette, and the Matcha Tea Mask, which will be going in a future giveaway. So that was everything in my box. Like I said, the average value they say is $175. Everything in my box this month totaled totaled $160.99. I mean, I didn't hit the average value, but I still got, you know, I paid $25 for this, so I am happy with it. I got some nice items in here. I didn't really get skincare, other than the mask that I'm not keeping, but I do think I'm going to have fun. I don't know if I'm going to keep that palette either. I did keep um, that Ofra palette because it was just so pretty, and I haven't touched it yet, but I may or may not keep it. But anyway, I want to thank you guys so much for stopping in, spending a little bit of time with me. Like I said, it means more to me than I can let you know. Um, if you've got this palette, um, have you used that sea glass color just for a pop of color or, or are you using it like all over the lid or, or maybe just to use as a really wide eyeliner type thing and maybe just at the on a corner or something like that. And what do you think of my Heidi Dolls necklace? I love this. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm a bad shopper. I, I like to do the clearances and the uh, returns and see what I can come up with. So, yeah, I, I really enjoy her line too. I just wish it was a little bit more affordable, but it is what it is. So anyway, I want to thank you guys again for stopping in, spending some time with me. I can't wait to be able to kind of catch up with YouTube. Um, I'm going to just keep taking it slow, taking a lot of rest, um, not doing as many videos. I'm, I think the Vlogmas type things from Christmas and then doing it again so soon, trying to do the Valentine's Day countdown was just a little bit too much for me. And um, you wouldn't think it would be because talking is something people do every day. But I think that's probably just, um, you know, the effects of having um, the COVID, the long COVID, having the fatigue and the, the symptoms like that is that you just, um, you just get worn down. And yeah, so you just kind of got to listen to your body and take some breaks here and there. But I'm so excited to be back and trying to do some videos here and there. And I got to have Mr. Griffin today. So yeah, my, my next door neighbor puppy came over and he got to spend the whole day with me. We took a lot of naps together. So yeah, so it's after midnight and I'm wide awake because I was napping all day with Mr. Griffin but yeah so anyway I hope you guys have a great week and we will all chat again soon love you guys bye bye